see your face everywhere When I'm going out, you'll be there Cause everything reminds me of you I can't take no more Girl, I think I'm losing my mind Try to go to work, but I lost track of time Cause everyone keep looking like you I can't take no more From your hands and your body It hurts so much To think of you as someone else Can't get enough When you're sweet talking to me Now I'm talking sweet over my All right, all right, all right Last minute for guys I'm here, I'm here in town just running some last minute errands before my big trip tomorrow can anybody guess what that is oh my gosh i'm so excited so guys yeah i'm back in the car now i'm super excited i will be going to the lovely island of saint lucia yes i have been wanting to go there as a matter of fact it was on my vision board for this year yeah, I had St. Lucia as well as Dubai on my vision board. But St. Lucia came through and tomorrow is the day. So I'm literally just running some last minute errands right now. So that I can go home and finish packing. I just also literally received my travel authorization from the St. Lucia government. I've been waiting on that for morning because without that it doesn't even make sense I go to the airport so I did my PCR test yesterday that came back negative thank God so I need that along with the travel authorization and also there's a health screening form that I need to have with me I'll fill that out tomorrow on my way there and present it at the airport when I land all right guys so there's a little preparation involved but hey I mean good things come with work right so I'm just doing the things that are required and I'll definitely take you guys on my journey I'll try to you know show you as much as possible so see you again tomorrow when the journey starts good morning guys good morning all right so I'm here at the airport at the Donald Sanctuary International Airport in Montego Bay I already checked in and everything. I am actually right now in the Club Mabe um, departure lounge. So um, just waiting on something to eat. So guys, if you're traveling, this is an excellent way to pass the time until your flight is ready, all right? So it's a beautiful air-conditioned lounge that gives you a free Wi-Fi access, unlimited food and beverage and nice air conditioned space very comfortable and when your flight is ready um they'll alert you so right now i'm pretty close to my gate as well so i'm just waiting to get some breakfast so that's also excellent too if you haven't gotten a chance to eat before you come to the airport then you can always book this service it's 30 dollars for adults and 20 dollars for children and um they also have restrooms and showers so for persons who probably, you know, you have an early morning flight, you probably didn't get a chance to, you know, do the necessaries, maybe wake up too late or whatever it is that would, you know, make you have to take a shower here. Then of course, that is also available for you. All right, so just going to give you a little view of what the space looks like. And this is just one of the lounges because they have many. very tasty exactly how I want it spicy
So guys, I just came off the, the hotel shuttle. This is a hotel that I'm staying overnight to catch my connection tomorrow. So I'm in Miami. Sorry guys, so like I said, this is my hotel that I'm staying at. Just for one night to connect tomorrow for St. Lucia. This is just the lobby area. a check-in desk right there all right so i just pretty much just checked in and i'm gonna you now make my way to my room oh lord tired.com tired tired i'm making my way now to the room So, this is my little cozy room. I'm, I actually like it. Um, pretty inexpensive nice place to stay the night you're connecting for another country or maybe you're going on a cruise or so you know you can just stay at one of these hotels which is like it's about 10 minutes from the airport and they provide a free shuttle so you just wait on your shuttle which comes by every hour on the hour so it's a pretty good service I'm gonna see if I can um, get myself settled. Um, I'm really gonna see if I can grab some stuff at the mall or somewhere close because this is my only opportunity to shop really. So I'm gonna see what I can get because it's still early, hey? Still early. So there's a lot to see and do right now. I ain't staying in no hotel right now. I'm going out, guys, I am going out. So yeah, see you later. Hey guys, so I'm back. I just literally came back off the road. Did a little bit of shopping, got some. Yup, yup, yup. So I am gonna try to get myself some food now. Really, really hungry, tired. So I'm gonna eat and then um, I see if I can get some rest. So I can catch my flight tomorrow. Um, I was thinking of going back out. You know, maybe hang out downstairs. But I might just go to bed. Because, you know, as your quinta morning. And I really need to be rested for tomorrow. Yeah, so all I did, I got my surprise. Yeah, that's got myself some chicken and fries. And somebody told me that they're rice and beans. It's pretty good so I got some of that as well guys you wouldn't believe say um oh okay 
and see what that is all about seem as if it's in a sauce or something so this is my first time trying papayas every time i come to the states never got the chance to have it so now i made sure i got some tonight so yeah that's it for now guys good night until tomorrow guys so it's almost time for me to board my flight now to go see lucia so as soon as i get there then the fun will begin all right so i'll keep you guys in the loop all right so that's it guys i had a hectic morning you know it was crazy but i made it didn't miss my flight you know and i had to you know check a second luggage because them semi bag overweight and you know who's not paying a hundred dollars right <laughs> to um check so i all i did and guys that's one thing you can do um always pack your bags with another little bag so in case you're overweight or anything because it's cheaper to pay $40 than a hundred so I just put some of this stuff over in an extra bag that I brought because I suspect because you know if, especially if you plan to shop you might have diff, um, extra weight than what you initially um, checked in so you want to make sure that you have um, somewhere to put that all right so that's what I did and yeah it cost me a little extra but i saved back myself some money because then i would pay a hundred dollars so i'm just here that delayed me a bit i thought i was gonna miss the the um the boarding time but i made it <laughs> so now i'm just waiting so i'll talk to you guys again when i get to the hotel all right bye Similar to a potato, but a little bit more fiber to it. Okay. Oh, wow. So we will good. take the skin off, put it to boil with salt and water to taste. Mm -hmm. The salt fish.
As far as we cannot see and she's going between the two last peak on the left between the two last, last peak, peak on, on the, the left. left okay the very far the very last the two of them and the, okay. the mountains you see in the horizon is the French island of Martinique mm. all right the same one we saw from the top. Okay. The capital. This is Castries, guys. Yes. Yeah. So I have to always save for all the guys at the hotel. <laughs> okay. And interestingly, St. Lucia is on lockdown right now. It's curfew time. So there's not much people on the road. Everywhere is closed. So I'm finally here at my resort. It's the Bay Garden Beach Resort in St. Lucia. I got in a little bit late, but I still want to give you the room tour before it gets darker. Yeah, can you see those houses behind me? Yeah, it's really a lovely country, really nice. Um, it reminds me of Jamaica, <laughs> where I'm from. You know, Caribbean islands, they all have something in common. But right now I'm going to show you the room and then tomorrow I can give you a tour of the property. All right, so let's go. tomorrow is gonna be my pool day because right now um, today is Saturday and um, the island is already closed down so there is a COVID um, based on their COVID restrictions they have a they have a curfew as of 4 p.m. on a Saturday and that goes until 4 a.m. on Monday morning and that is until the 15th of October yeah so um, I'm gonna be in resort tomorrow as well. I'm just gonna use that as my, you know, day to relax and stuff. And um, on Monday, I have a site inspection at Stonefield Villa, which of course I'll show you what that looks like also. 
then of course the excursions and fun starts um, on a Tuesday now um, here at so Bay, Bay Gardens Hotel is like a chain of resorts so I'm at Bay Gardens Hotel you have Bay Gardens Beach Resort and across from this hotel you have Bay Gardens Inn so when you're staying at one you have access to all three properties so you know you can go to anyone you want you can dine you don't necessarily have to stay here and dine at this resort um, I'll be having you know lunch at Bay Gardens Resort maybe tomorrow the beach resort also um, that's where I'm gonna do my spa treatment also so I'll do a little um, a little tour of that property also all right all right now I'm tired so I'm going to take a shower maybe go downstairs for dinner not sure if I want to do that or maybe order room service because that is also a part of the service here yeah so even though they're small they try to you know include every little thing so I may do that and you know just browse around for the rest of the night and get some rest all right guys so I'll definitely take you on every step of the journey with me you won't be left out of anything all right at least nothing important <laughs> I'll try to include you in everything so of course um, out for now until tomorrow okay guys Bye. so remember I mentioned I wasn't sure if I was gonna go out for dinner tonight or just stay in an order room service well as it is the tiredness one and I stayed in order some room service looks good tastes good too I have buffalo wings french fries vegetables and shrimp I also have over here mashed potato I have a blended fruit punch and the St. Lucia local bear, the piton. So I'm going to dig in right now. I took a taste of the chicken and trust me, it tastes really good. So I'm going to dig in. All right, guys. Good night. Good morning guys good morning happy Sunday so I just literally got up out of bed and now on my way to breakfast yeah felt like I didn't want to get up any at all <laughs> but you know you have to get up and start enjoying yourself so yep making my way to breakfast now Oh, let me show you my outfit. I'm just wearing a cute little dress. Yeah, nice slippers. Yeah, so that's the breakfast outfit. <laughs> This is not the national dish without the pigs though, right? 
look at what she gave me guys what is this called bakes, bakes. so i got bakes and oh. cod fish or salt fish with veg yep what else do you have yes, and bacon yeah. all right may i have some bacon please no omelet just for the waitress. Pardon? Okay. So yep guys, simple you know and nice. Hmm? You know hey guys, so I got myself some fruits, a yogurt and of course bacon, salt fish and veggies and bakes. So I'm gonna have some tea with this. And that's about it. The lockdown, you feel like you will come back and do, do it over again? Come back to the show? No. Well, I'm actually used to the lockdown. Okay. Because it's the same thing in Jamaica. Yeah. But it's not so rigid where you can't move, actually. Okay. You can do excursions. Yeah. But you have to do the ones that are approved. Oh, yeah. So you can go to the front desk and you can usually ask. Yeah you know what's approved for you to do you just can't move around free on your own yeah. i take a taxi go here there yeah. and everywhere yeah but you can do stuff yeah. and you have access to the the bay gardens oh, beach right. resort yeah. yeah i was actually trying to rent a car when i came here but it was mm -hmm. like oh well, you can't rent the thing since you are you know not uh -huh. fully blessing you to by the way guys, I met a lovely friend on vacation, meet her. <laughs> you don't mind, do you? No. Hello. <laughs> yeah, that's my friend that I met. She's also traveling solo and we're having breakfast now. Yes, I'm not talking to myself. <laughs> so guys, I also decided to get myself an omelet. Yeah, and of course, a little chocolate tea. Yeah? Oh. Trying out the salt fish. Yeah. You got They have like these bakes. It's kind of similar to dumpling, fried dumpling, but it's like more of a cake texture, really soft and nice. Broken, it looks like this, really nice. Pretty good, food is good here. So um, guys, remember I mentioned to you that Bay Gardens is like a hotel chain, so you have the hotel the inn the haven and the beach resort and once you stay at one you have access to all they have a shuttle that actually takes you to each one according to your wish right so right now i am at the bay gardens beach resort and i'm just gonna give you a little tour So this one is of course the bigger property or maybe I should say the biggest and this is where the beach is at. So you have a lot of persons coming over to this one. I wanted to put this one initially but because it didn't tell me that if I stayed here I would have access to all three However, that was the case for the hotel. So I figured I would just book the one that gives me access. You blame me? <laughs> so when I came now, I realized that once you're staying at anyone, you really have access to all. So this is the lobby area. Yeah, that's the lobby right there. I go through here just to show you the sides yeah this is like a little side porch yeah making my way through the lobby this is a front desk hello <laughs> okay. 
and this is the outer lobby area. So here you have a lot of beachfront rooms as well. And the beachfront rooms are suites. Hey! <laughs> so I'm making my way down to the beach. Maybe um, I will give you also a view of the rooms also as soon as I get to it. But I'm just giving you the exterior of the property. I'm just showing you the exterior right now. So that's the beach right there. So I'm going to be spending my time today. Really nice. The first thing that caught my eyes, apart from the floaters out in the water, <laughs> Guys, I'm a kid at heart. I love floaters, trampolines, the whole nine yards. But apart from that, I was looking at the beautiful mountain range. Oh my God. I don't think I appreciate um, the mountain range this much at home. For some reason, being in a different space, it um, appeals to me more. Look at that guys, look at that. That's so beautiful. Wow. And it just falls right into the ocean. This is lovely. Yep, yep, yep. So, that's it. I'm going to go ahead and just some um, change so I can go in the water. Girl, I see your face everywhere. When I'm going out, you'll be there. Cause everything reminds me of you. I can't take no more. Girl, I think I'm losing my mind. Try to go to work, but I lost track of time. Cause everyone keep looking like you. I can't take no more. From your hands and your body It hurts so much To think of you as someone else Can't get enough When you're sweet talking to me Now I'm talking sweet all by myself Put your arms around me Put your faith in me Put your love on me drink and get my day started okay guys so this is what I decided to try today it's the day's special it's um it's called the bell play that's how it's pronounced and of course these are all the stuff that is inside of it so I'm gonna try it I'll let you see it as soon as I get it Problem. So guys, this is what it looks like. Yeah, let me taste. Mmm, this is good. I like it guys. It's nice. Mmm. Mmm. Really nice. Hey guys, so I'm all ready and dolled up for dinner as you can see. Let me show you my outfit. Yeah, so cute. Yeah. So that's my outfit for tonight and I'll be having dinner at the Bay Gardens Beach Resort which is where I went to the beach today that's the other property so I'm just waiting on the shutter to come by and it's here 
So stay tuned so I can share dinner with you. <laughs> I tell you, this dress is so embarrassing, <laughs> but I love it. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, so let's see what we're going to have tonight. Feeling seafoodish. Alright, so. Okay, guys, so dinner is here. So I got the fish in the banana wrap, some veggies. And I got a potato salad. Yeah. Um, let's see what this feel, what this tastes like. Hmm. This is delicious, guys. Very flavorful. Very flavorful. I don't know what kind of fish it is though, but it tastes really good. Mm -hmm. And this is the pie. And see how the pie tastes. This is also pretty good. Dinner tastes good guys. I'm sure I'm gonna enjoy it guys it's so, so nice here and the staff is very accommodating very service oriented they go above and beyond to assist you in any way they can it's really really nice the resort also has three pools so this one good morning how are you yes I'm good <laughs> like a nice little garden and pool view and this is my view right here so this is the second pool on property and these rooms at the bottom here they have direct access to the pool and garden perfect for families especially if you have small kids Besides this one, we have a smaller pool, which is a little bit more private up here. Yeah, and a small little waterfall. So this would be like the middle of the property. Now making my way down to the other side 
Now these ones, they're the Croton Sweets. Hi, Mike. Oh my God, this is my friend that I met on vacation. He is a, such a sweetheart. So he's just chilling right now. <laughs> Guys, I met so many nice people on this trip. It is amazing. Like, trust me, I don't feel like I'm doing a solo travel right now. I just feel like, you know, I came here with company and everybody is doing their own thing. Hi, good morning. <laughs> See, everybody here is so friendly and nice. All right, so now I am down by the Croton Suites. And as the name suggests, these are just sweets. It's um, the more modern side of the property. And of course, um, here you can get the sweets if you have like a huge family or maybe, you know, you, you have friends or you want much more space. So this is where you would be. And down here is where we have the third pool. So it's right here. And down here is a little bit more upscale as well. You pay a little bit more for these rooms. Not only because they're sweets, but yeah. Based on the amenities that are provided and stuff like that. And by the way, um, the resort actually has 87 rooms. So it's a small boutique resort. And it has a lovely homey type of vibe really nice it's like you're you know walking out in your own yard that building over there is the washroom <laughs> So guys that's about it for right now um the the property it's not huge it's like really small and homey beautiful um like i said it has 87 rooms the staff is amazing the service here is impeccable the food is good trust me like <laughs> i was i was pleasantly surprised at how tasty the meals are like you know sometimes you travel and you go to different caribbean islands and the food may not you know be so nice but trust me <laughs> i can't stop eating guys and you have like different type of meal plans here um you have the all-inclusive you have the breakfast plan and of course when you if you decide not to take the all-inclusive you are because of where the hotel is located you have access to restaurants supermarkets shopping you name it so like this hotel is lim is literally five minutes walk from the rodney bay mall so right now this location is lovely and it's based on where it is you have access to any excursion on the island that you want to do so it's amazing if you ever plan to come here you can contact me i can book your reservations and give you all the details and advice that you need all right hey guys today i'll be doing a tour of the lovely stonefield villa resort right here in saint lucia i'll be giving you a few highlights of the tour as i'll be doing a separate video which you can watch later let's go
yeah country opens back up today you know who is going out so i'm all dressed for my excursion but we'll be picking up in about 10 minutes so i'm getting a quick bite um this is one so i'm having stewed chickpeas with um sauteed tuna and potato i have also yogurt fruits banana bread and of course yeah i told you about the yogurt already and the chocolate tea is on its way so yeah this is my quick bite before i go i will keep you posted on all my activities right. okay guys so i'm at the marina um it's gonna be snorkeling i'm going to the pitons i'm gonna be doing the sulfur springs and maybe like a tour around the island so right now i'm going on the boat These are all the persons I'm boarding with. This is it. Say good morning, Tis. Good morning. <laughs> Later, guys. Welcome to the right hand side of the catamaran. You are on National Park and Landmark Pigeon Island. Pigeon Island was once an island on its own, but back in the 70s, they built a causeway joining St. Lucia to Pigeon Island. So these two hotels were not here before. You have the Sandals yeah. brand with the red roof setting, and that is the second largest Sandals out of the three. It is open. Right now, some lovely music will be put on for you guys, so let us enjoy our ride down. Thank you. <laughs> guys this excitement that you're now seeing on board is that epic moment when somebody's money blew away in the water and of course the crew is trying to retrieve it of course they didn't get it it was about three dollars and they just decided that you know it wasn't worth it so we just continued sailing but that was of course a nice little icebreaker in the cruise just thought i would share that with you I wasn't able to air the excitement and all of that because of copyright concerns because they were playing music on board. But yeah, that's what that was all about. You think you can have just me? Girl, I see your face everywhere. When I'm going out, you'll be there. Cause everything reminds me of you. I can't take no more. Girl, I think I'm losing my mind. Try to go to work, but I lost track of time. Everyone keep looking like you, I can't take no more I miss your touch from your hands and your body It hurts so much to think of you as someone else Can't get enough when you're sweet talking to me Now I'm talking sweet all by myself Put your arms around me, put your faith in me, put your love on me I'm getting off the boat now guys I'm gonna start the actual tour yes, we're on the actual thank tour. you <laughs> thank you <laughs> so I changed off into this swimsuit um, I'm gonna do the sulfur bath in the mud guys <laughs> in the volcanic mud so 
I wanted to wear something that in case it doesn't come back to and it gets spoiled then I can afford to you know let it go so something simple and dark in color yeah I bought my shorts over it when I get there I take off my shorts and this is the line to go out so we're in one of the towns here in St. Lucia called Sufri. So this is the action town. This is where everything takes place. Really nice. Say hi. <laughs> no necklace for me today, sorry. <laughs> I'm sure you have something special for me. <laughs> hey guys, we have just arrived at Sulphur Springs. This is the world's only drive in volcano and the top attraction in St. Lucia. This site, guys, is technically a volcano. Yes, it is. <laughs> Hence the hot springs and the sulfur. But it's considered to be dormant now because it hasn't erupted in over 200 years. Yup. And guys, people from all over the world travel to here just to take a bath in the hot black water you see there. Yeah, man, and I'm going to definitely be enjoying that bath today. It's believed to cure, well, let me not say cure, but it's believed to treat a lot of ailments and skin conditions. So what persons usually do is to lather themselves with the sulfur, um, sort of create a mask out of it, and then you rinse off in the hot water. Can we stop the clock and rewind? Go back to that moment in time. When you say you want me for that, well, I, I gave my all to deserve ya. Begging on my knees just to show ya. You're the one I want and I love ya. No, 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 no lie. I miss your touch from your hands and your body. It hurts so much to think of you as someone else. All right, so we're now at the Toral Waterfalls, going up. Mm, so magnificent, look at that. Guys, banana ketchup. Banana ketchup, guys. Just like ketchup, but banana made it. You tried already? Everyone just plain coconut rum like that. Tastes really good too. Tastes like ketchup, but has a banana flavor. Stuff tastes good. St. Lucia is innovative. These people create all type of things. And you can pick out any four of your sort of your choice but don't forget to get the mud and the sulfur that's the best one. oh yeah the sulfur soap you can leave this one Watch in your sure. five to ten minutes yeah. and how much for the how much for the black one it's three for ten but i'll give you four because of your tall oh that's ec dollars us 25 ec 10 oh US. 25 ec 10 us okay really yeah that. that one it gets rid of the bumps mm -hmm. Okay. Wet it, let it form a mass on your face and let it settle for a while, then you rinse it off. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Let me pour it for the sun. So guys, I got these two, the sulfur soap and the mud soap because they said that it's good for acne and I have a lot of that. So hopefully it works. Let's 
So I hope you guys liked my first vlog. Please stay tuned for part two.